right in the previous video we looked at uh, the general setting option which is the gear right there we looked at this anything which is stored on your iPad or if you want to access anything which is stored on your blog right on your portfolio so we're talking about all your posts and pages if you want to access that you do it from here in this video I'm going to talk about the plus sign in these menus over here all right now the plus sign is how you add a new blog so if you want to start a new blog post on on Bloxy on your iPad you tap on the plus sign and that's how you start a new blog now remember every blog has a title and at the moment it says untitled meaning the blog actually doesn't have a name so remember every time you blog your blog should have a name and it could be task 1, task 2 task on reflection, task to evidence, whatever it is, please make sure that you type it in. Alright, and this is how you add a new blog post. Alright, I'm going to talk about these options over here. This is Safari, which is equivalent to Firefox on your computer, so that's how you browse the internet, right? This over here gives you access to all the pictures you have taken on your iPad or your iPhone if you're using Bloxy on your iPhone. So that's how you access all your pictures. Now this is Flickr and we are not using this in the course. This is where all the pictures go, right? So Pix for short and it's called Picasa. Right, that's where all the pictures go. This is YouTube. This is YouTube and this is where you'll find all your videos. Now remember, you can't upload videos onto YouTube from here. Uh, you have to upload it to YouTube the way I showed you before, right? So there's another video which shows you how to upload pictures on videos, sorry, videos on YouTube. This only will give you access to the videos which are already on YouTube, all right? So you remember, you can't upload anything to YouTube from Bloxy. You can only access however you can upload pictures all right so i'll show you that this over here is searching anything on the internet so just like you do a google search that's what that is this over here and you don't have to worry about these ones here because we're not going to use it in the course all right so in the next step i'm going to show you how to upload pictures using bloxy to picasa or if you or to your blog Alright, as you can see, I have chosen this over here, that means I've tapped on it, and what it gives me is everything, all the pictures on my iPad, right? So what you need to do from here is, you need to choose the pictures which you want to use on your blog, and you then need to upload it into the envelope. As you can see, the envelope is empty, so what you're doing is, you're choosing the picture, and you're dragging it, you're dragging the picture into the envelope, right? Right, so from the previous uh, slide, we were here, that's a collection of all the pictures on your iPad. When you tap on this, this is what comes up, right? So it's all the pictures on your iPad. Now what you need to do is, you need to drag the pictures you want to use on your blog into the envelope over here. Remember the envelope is empty, so you drag and drop. You hold the picture with your finger and drag it inside the envelope, right? Okay. So as you can see from these menus over here where I, I had all the pictures, I dragged three pictures into the envelope, right? And you can see that the envelope is no longer empty. It has got pictures over here, right? So once you've done that, remember, it's still not uploaded. You have to upload, right? It says step to upload. So you have to touch this option here. You have to tap on it and it will start the upload process. So it will upload it to Picasa. Alright, so remember this. Uh, this process is very important. Once you've chosen these pictures, you need to tap to upload and this will put it into Picasa. Alright, that's where it will go. So I'll do it again. Once you've put the pictures into the envelope, you tap on this 
and this will upload it to Picasa over here. Alright, that's the yellow line. Alright. Alright, now that we have uploaded the pictures to Picasa, pardon me, now that we have uploaded the pictures to Picasa, that's there, when you tap on it, these are the options you can see. Alright, and the options are my photos, so the options are my photos, albums, and search. Now, my photos, my photos will have, let me do this again. Alright, so my photos will have, my photos will have all the pictures, all the pictures you have upload it all right okay so when you tap on my up uh, my pictures or my photos this is what you have got on Picasa right this is what everything is on Picasa that's under your profile line now if you want to use any of these pictures in your blog what you have to do is you have to hold your finger on the picture you want to use and drag it into your blog Right, so this is your post. This is where the picture will go. So you need to drag and drop. Right, so you hold the picture. You hold the picture with your finger. You hold the picture with your finger, and you drag it, and drop it into this white space over here, anywhere over here. Right, and it will automatically come into your blog. And remember, you need to give it a title. Right, the title should be there. Every blog post should have a title. Alright, so that's how you insert a picture. What I'm going to show you is how to access your videos on YouTube next um, and then put it in, on your blog, right? It's not different to how you insert a picture. Alright, as you can see, this is YouTube and I've clicked on it. So these are the things which I can see. My uploads, very similar to my photos on Picasa. And this is where you'll find all the videos which you have uploaded to YouTube, alright? Okay, so let's see what happens next. Alright, as you can see, I clicked on... Sorry. As you can see, I tapped on my uploads and these are all the videos I've got. Now, if I want to use a video in my blog, again, same as inserting a photo onto your blog, what you do is you hold your finger on top of the video you want to insert and drag it inside here, right inside the white space, the white space, and then it will automatically insert itself into the blog. Remember again, it needs to have a title. At the moment, my blog doesn't have a title. So again, the step is you click on YouTube. This will load this. My up uh, my uploads, and this will load all the videos. Alright, all the videos you have uploaded. And to insert it into your blog, you choose the video, hold it with your finger and drag it into this white space. And it will insert the video into your blog. And you can start typing. And you type by clicking on this small triangle. That's where you enter the text. Alright, so to summarize in this video, we have seen how to upload pictures using Bloxy into Picasa, how to access all the pictures you've uploaded into Picasa, how to insert the picture into your blog. We've also seen how to access all the videos you have on YouTube and how to insert them on your blog, right? Now remember, you can upload pictures using Bloxy, but you can't access or you can't upload videos using Bloxy to YouTube, right? That's a separate process. And if you want to use a video, you, you, might, you have to make sure that you've already uploaded it. I've shown that to you in another video. You first upload the video and then you click on YouTube in Bloxy My Uploads and it will give you all the lists, all right? Every video you have taken and then you've uploaded to YouTube. And then you drag it, drag and drop it into this white space over here. All right.